Hi, we're Matt and Deb Simsek, and we're members of Trinity. And we want to tell you the top 10 things we love about Trinity. Number 10, having a safe way to gather together during COVID to worship at the drive-in. Number 9, watching bald eagles soar while worshiping at the drive-in. Number 8, worship music from Phil and Robin. Number 7, weekly messages that both comfort and challenge us. Number 6, the coolest pastors in the valley. Number five, daily prayers from Pastor Chris on her Facebook. Number four, Trinity's mission outreach continues through the pandemic and the rioting. Number three, our church believes in and trusts science and is working to get us all safely back to the big house to worship together this fall. Number two, our circle of Trinity friends, many of which we met at church decades ago, and they like to drink wine. Number one reason, knowing we are part of an inclusive, loving, open-minded faith community. Stay safe, Trinity. Hi, I'm John Fogelberg, member of Trinity Lutheran Church in Stillwater and proud of it. I'm the interim president of the retired men's group at Trinity. I love going to the Sunday school when it's available and enjoy going to the weekly Bible study, whether it's on Zoom or in person. I also participate in Food for Thought and the Trinity golf groups when available and volunteer as needed for the many activities available at Trinity. I'm extremely grateful for the friendships that I've made over the years and the opportunity to serve our community as part of a group effort. And as a lifelong learner, I just love the opportunity to learn more about the Bible. And I think I've learned more in my retirement years than all my years of formal uh, training in high school and college. So uh, my final message would be to the retired men, come join us. You'll love it. You'll, it's a wonderful experience. We'll look forward to seeing you. Thank you. Hi, I'm Sheila Maybanks. I'm a member of Trinity. This is Cormac. And I'm grateful for the really innovative and beautiful services we've had online. Always lovely music and an inspiring sermon. Thanks, Trinity. Hi, we're Jill and Josh Longnecker, and we're members of Trinity Lutheran Church. These days, we're very grateful for our Trinity community. Even though we can't be worshiping together in the physical building, we're still staying connected with online worship and time at the drive-in church. And we're grateful that we still have our couples group and Bible studies that are active. We were able to do Zoom meetings, and we had a chance to uh, meet at a park to have a socially distanced lunch with our couples group, and it was so great to see everybody. We know it's hard being apart, but even seeing people on the streets out for a walk or in the grocery store when you see a friend from Trinity, it brightens your day. Mm -hmm. So even though we physically can't be together in the building, uh, we know that uh, we're grateful that we're all together in spirit. Hi, Trinity team. This is Mel Sullivan. I am a member of Trinity, as well as my husband, Jim Brown. I'm super grateful to be a part of lots of different things at Trinity. Um, my husband plays in the band and has a great affinity towards the mandolin and many other acoustic guitars and electric guitars. And I have a love for the council and the people that work in the leadership role where I have the privilege to serve. And we're so grateful that Trinity and the team is still continuing to be committed to serving, to looking out for our community, as well as um, to continue to foster all the great things that we do. So thank you, Trinity. Thank you, Trinity Lutheran Church. We're super grateful for all of you and for what we do in this community. Hey, Trinity, I'm Pastor Peter, and we are the church. Thank you for being always open, hopeful, and serving our neighbor for the sake of God's mission in the world. We continue to be the body of Christ in all circumstances.